so I'm really starting to like H&M they show you what you look like if you're fabulous and then for those of you that are not fabulous they show you what you'd look like if you're not <laughs> Hello everybody, it's been a minute since we've vlogged, but we hope you all are doing fantastic. We've missed vlogging the last couple days. It's Bryson's been under the weather, then Hudson's been under the weather, and it's just been a bit of a roller coaster in our household. But we hope you all are staying healthy, especially during this holiday season and the with the weather change. So, what are we doing right now, baby? Well, we are, um, I have a gimbal that I bought for the camera, but it's not going to work in the way I want it to. So, um, I'm taking it back to go back to Amazon and you know, all that fun stuff. But after that, Jackson has a, uh, procedure that we're going to get a consultation on. Um, so we have to he drive. Has to have a procedure. Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, so we're driving a couple hours north going to Fresno area and then um, we're gonna have a, a special dinner tonight it's my favorite place I ever I was going to surprise him but then I was like he's driving so I can't really surprise him if he's driving alrighty so just finished that up um, got that gimbal dropped off and now we are fixing to head out on the road but Audrey, of course, wants some Dutch Brothers or something. So that's probably what we're going to do. Yeah, she always gets her way, I feel like. Excuse me. Mm. Can I get your number? Okay. Can I get your number? Yeah. Yeah. I thought she was going to say as long as she got Dutch Brothers. Oh. As long as I get Dutch Brothers. <laughs> Too late. You already said yes. Okay. So we weren't planning on going into too much detail about um, Jackson, but what he has is called hypospadias. If you want to know what that is, look it up. Look it up. Um, so we are going to a urologist down in Fresno um, to see what needs to be done because he does have to have a procedure to correct the deformity. So. We have to see a specialist and we will find out in the morning exactly um, what needs to be done. They said if it's just a minor for them, if, to them, if it's minor, to us it's like scary, but to them if it's minor, they'll fix it tomorrow. Hopefully that's what we were told, I was told by the nurse. Um, but if not, we'll have to go back and we'll have to, he'll have to actually have the procedure there. Yeah, and it's, you know, stuff like this, it, it's not really a huge procedure, a huge deal, but just the fact that knowing that your child's gonna be in pain when you're going through the procedure or after the procedure, it's it's so hard. It's I don't like thinking about it, and it's, I, as much as I, um, I hate, pain and needles and stuff I'd rather take his spot so he doesn't have to go through it which is crazy because I'm yeah as a parent it's it's hard to see when your children going through pain or anything and he's not hurting now but after the procedure he's definitely going to be in some pain Ferrari <laughs> you don't see many of those here where we live no <laughs> I would love to have one actually I, I'd much rather have a Lamborghini but if I was given a Ferrari, I'd take it in a heartbeat. 2,000 years later. Well, we just made it to the hotel. I got Audrey and Jackson up to the room. I hate when there's a long walk to the room. I will say, this hotel is actually really nice. Um, I actually booked this hotel specifically for one thing. Um, close but there's something that I really like that this hotel has I'll show you in a second room tour got the uh, kitchen over here this room came with a beautiful wife as well it's interesting how that works it's got a little room here with the TV right there walk into the master bedroom yes our stuff is kind of all over the place because we just got here now for the reason why I really wanted this room. 
Yes. Hot tub, jacuzzi. Oh yeah. All right, it's time for the official bed test. Here we go. I forgot to take my glasses off. <laughs> well, don't you look pretty. Ready for dinner? I am so hungry. I am so hungry right now. Yeah. So we did leave Hudson with my mom and dad because we can't take him in with us to the doctor's office because knowing him, he'd be like everywhere and would not be patient. So he's at home with my mom and dad. Yeah, and I just realized I have this on the wide lens. I should probably change it. There we go. That's a little bit better. Wait for me. She's leaving me. Well, we have to hurry because our reservation's in like 20 minutes. And it's only six miles away, but um, it's supposed to take about 20 minutes to get there because of traffic. And they will only hold our reservation for five minutes. So we gotta hurry. Ooh, it's 45. We gotta really hurry because yeah. the reservation's at six. Oh, it's dark out here. It's dark. We made it. Hey, baby. Hey. What you gonna get? That makes two of us. That is what's left of my food. And that's what's left you guys, of this is so much food. We tried. It's the best I can say. <sighs> After trying all we could to eat everything, this is still what's left between mine and Audrey's plate. Holy cow. Was that enough food for you? Yeah. But I'm Time. still getting my tea. <laughs> Hey baby, hmm. I think you're gonna have to call an ambulance. Am I gonna have to roll you out of here? Uh huh. Okay. That was way too much food. That was so good though. It was amazing food. So if you guys are ever in Fresno, it's actually Clovis, but yeah, Fresno. Clovis, Fre Fresno area. It's Tokyo it. Steakhouse, oh, 1865. Right there, 1865 Herndon. Avenue. It is my favorite restaurant. If you guys are here in Fresno, Clovis area, trust me, it's worth it. It's a little pricey. We don't come here that often, but it is so worth it. Literally, you could share. Yes. You could. Yes. Hey, baby. Mm -hmm. It's cold. It's a little cold. I I'm cold. I'm a little cold. Um. Yeah. We just got out of the truck and there's these people walking by and what happened? And so he's like, oh, are you here for pictures? And I was like... No, he like, said, he, he didn't even say that. He just looked straight as he goes, Santa pictures? And I was like, well, I didn't hear Santa. Oh, so I'm yeah. like, pictures? I was like, what are you talking about? And he goes, yeah, you know, for the pictures. And I was like... 
were like, I don't know. What? And, and I'm like, just looking at him kind of funny because I feel bad. So I'm like, I don't know what the heck this, I mean, what the guy is talking about. And um, he goes, you know, for the Santa pictures. I'm like, oh, I don't know. We're not from here. <laughs> well, we are not here for Santa pictures. <laughs> it was funny though. She's like, she's like, yeah, we're not from here. So, oh. Well, welcome. Well, welcome. <laughs> so. so we're here at one of Audrey's favorite places. Teasers. Teasers World Tea Market? Yeah. Yes. What'd I get? You got a Malibu Kiss. Malibu Kiss. That's what it's called. So we'll see if it's any good. Hopefully it is. Audrey told me I had to go get a picture of Mickey and Minnie for Hudson. So I'm on a mission right now to go take a picture of Minnie and Mickey for Hudson. Okay. This is the line. And well, it, it goes enough. all the way back over there. No, thank you. Hi, buddy. Hi. Oh my word, you look so cold right oh. now. Your cheeks look all funny. How are you doing, handsome? Hey, babe. Yes. I got a joke for you. Okay. What's white and black and makes grown men scared? I have no idea. Audrey shopping. I said grown men, but really I meant one grown man. This one. Yeah. Am I really a grown man though? No. I mean, physically I might be, but mentally I'm definitely far from grown. I have a question for you. Yes, baby. Am I going to be broke after this? No. I have a second question for you. Yes. Am I already broke? Yes. <laughs> so, Audrey got me a hot tea. How long ago did we get the tea? What, like 30 minutes ago maybe? About 30 minutes ago. I just got my first taste of the hot tea and I still burned my tongue and it's been 30 minutes. It is so stinking hot. Oh hey look. Look at that handsome guy. <laughs> Funny thing was my wife is at least 10-15 feet away from me and all of a sudden I hear <laughs> I'm really starting to like H&M. They show you what you look like if you're fabulous. And then, for those of you that are not fabulous, they show you what you'd look like if you're not. Well, two things just happened. A miracle and disappointment. and disappointment. The miracle was we walked into an H&M, did not spend a dime. The disappointment was, not for me, but for her, that we walked into an H&M and didn't spend a dime. I never want to spend money. I just really wanted that top. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I never want to spend money. That jacket was like two sizes too big, and then that shirt was probably like a size too big. And then all they had was an extra small. Now the this, big question. This chicky no extra small. Hey, now the big question. What? What aisle did we park on? That one. I guess we parked over here. Well, anyways, guys, we hope you all had a wonderful day. Uh, we had a actually that was a pretty fun day. I enjoyed it. We're gonna go back to the hotel We're gonna relax for a little bit um, Yeah, cuz we got to get up early tomorrow get Jackson to his doctor's appointment and get home in time for church tomorrow night For church cuz yeah. I have to sing for the church tomorrow. Yeah So we have My a busy day tomorrow. Home. Yeah, but anyways, we hope you guys had a wonderful day Don't forget to like comment subscribe tell all your friends about us Don't forget to smile and as always, guys, you are amazing. Don't forget that. It's been real. Good night. Good night. Looks like we're spending more money than I thought we were going to.